Ping considered getting an invitational. At the time, I think we had six tournaments uh, across the country, and we were looking at doing something at an invitational level. You see it every year at this event, uh, with it being the last event before the Rolex Junior All-American teams are made, and players making that last push for Rolex Junior Player of the Year. I know John Solheim was excited about hosting it here, uh, and providing the players at a young age uh, a feeling of, what we consider this a major, uh, as far as the AJJ schedule. It's gonna separate the best players from the good players. And I think that's ultimately what you want from a championship golf course, is you wanna know who's the best at that week at any given point and, and how do they handle this golf course. It really transitions well to uh, the college game as well. Coaches see this as a place that uh, really brings out the best in all the players. This is just by far one of my favorite courses. Um, it's so much more difficult than all the other ones and it's always in great shape. The course is just absolutely perfect. It challenges you in every way possible. There's no easy hole out here and the person who played the best this week always comes out on top. Uh, Jeff Brown and his crew over at Ping really did a great job this year with the bag. Uh, it's a tremendous look. It's the nice camo bag that you'll see a lot of. I remember last year when I got the bag, I was like, I don't even care how I play. I have the bag. So that just makes this tournament really special just with everything that goes into it. We take a lot of pride in, in designing the bags each year, trying to come up with something to push the limits on what we can do with a golf bag. Really added a touch to it this year and put each player's state flag on it. Uh, it's a really, really neat concept and the bags look awesome. We're blessed with a tremendous volunteer base. Um, we can put together an event of this size in two weeks. Uh, we've got close to 400 volunteers we can call on. Uh, the community supports golf here in Stillwater like no community I've ever been a part of. Yeah, the volunteers out here are, are tremendous. Um, you know, we've got two spotters on every hole. We've got a walking score with every group. At a golf course like this, that's as challenging and as difficult as we have here. Uh, it wouldn't be possible without them. As a company, we're very fortunate and very happy to be a part of what the AGJ does.